Hello guys and welcome back to my channel. I hope you are ready and excited for another organization video. Today we are tackling the desk and office area. You know how when you buy new cute gym outfits it makes you more motivated to work out? It's kind of like that with your desk. If you have a nice clean and organized desk, it makes you more motivated to work. At least that's the idea that we're going for. So we're gonna take care of our desk area so we can all get to work, be bosses, get stuff done. If you are new here, definitely subscribe to my channel. I do cleaning, organization, healthy lifestyle videos. So if you're interested in that kind of stuff, I would love to have you as a subscriber. And with all of that said, let's go ahead and jump into it. So the first step as with all of my organization videos is you just want to clear out your space, move everything away, give your desk area a nice little wipe down so you have a clean slate to get started. We're gonna start with just the basics. First is the desk drawer organization. I found these drawer organizers at TJ Maxx. They have them at the dollar store, Walmart. Anywhere you go, you can find these very basic drawer organizers. You just wanna find one that fits your drawers. It's just gonna give you a compartmentalized space to put your office supplies so they don't roll all around in the drawer as you're opening it and closing it. So this is definitely something you want to do if you have a desk drawer. This next element is something that I actually showed in a video a long time ago, and that is putting a cord basket under your desk. All you need to do for this is get these little hooks, I found them on Amazon, screw them on to the underside of your desk, and then I found this little cord basket, and then you put your outlet hub in the basket so that you don't have to see cord clutter. I only have one cord that is coming from my desk. So the setup I have on my desk is I have a laptop and I plug that into an external monitor. So I will link down below the monitor that I use and it does connect to any type of laptop. And the way I have this set up to max my space is I found this glass monitor stand. So the monitor goes on top of that and it also elevates the monitor to a better height so that it's right in line with my vision so I'm not hunched over on my desk. Now I found some really cool monitor organization accessories. One are these little pen holders. They stick on to the bottom of your monitor and you can put your pens there. So you could put your markers in one, your pens in one, your highlighters in one, and just have them very easily accessible. I also think they look really cool on your monitor. It doesn't take up any desk space. The next thing for your monitor is this stick-on plastic pad, which can be used to put post-it notes. So I now have a little system I do where my top priority task of the day, I put on post-it notes. And it's a great visual system because as you're looking at your screen, your tasks are right there. So you're not gonna forget. Now I'm gonna show a few different desk pad options that I found. This first one I found at Target. I really like it. It is a week overview planner. It has the days of the week, a notes section, and then also a goals section. So this is something you can keep out on your desk and stay nice and organized. This next one I also found at Target a lot more simple, but takes up less space on your desk. It's just a Monday through Sunday little post-it note planner that you can quickly jot down what you have going on during your week. This next one I thought was kind of cool and different. It is a desk pad planner that also doubles as a mouse pad. So there's a plastic sheet you can lift up and you can put post-it notes, you can even write down. There's different sections for weekly plans, to-do lists. So I like that this is a dual purpose item you could have on your desk. And this last thing I found, this is a more in-depth desk pad. So there's the year-long monthly calendar, you have a monthly planner, a to-do list. With this one, I like it because it has that aqua pop of color, so it looks really pretty on your desk. Another thing that I always like to keep on my desk is my phone. So I found this awesome dual purpose phone holder. So on the front side, you can prop your phone up and then in the back, there is a pen holder. You can also put your scissors or other frequently used office supply items here. Next thing I want to show you guys is this desk tray. So this sits above your keyboard. So it's kind of dead space that you wouldn't otherwise be using and you can put your quick 
grab easy access items on here. So your post-it notes, your phone, any other frequently used items, just keep them all right here. This is a really cool mini shelf and I just love the idea of this because I can use it to put my recipe book, my one line a day mom book, the things that I need to grab frequently, I can have them on their own little mini bookshelf. If you don't have a drawer, another great option for office supply storage is this cute little desk tray. So one space you could put your post-it notes, you could put your pens, any other office supplies that you use frequently, you can put them here and it just looks nice on your desk. I don't actually have any file cabinets or desk drawers in my office. Instead, what I decided to do was buy an inexpensive Ikea dresser and use that for my office and craft supplies organization. And one last finishing touch I like to do in my office is I have this over the door hook. I found this at the dollar store and I use this to hang my purse and my jacket when I come in just to prevent any type of mess. It keeps the room more organized. So that is everything. Here's what my desk looks like all put together. All right guys, so those are my organization ideas for today. Please give it a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. And I also decided to do a little giveaway for all of you who are still watching to the end of the video. To be entered, you just need to be subscribed to my channel and let me know in the comments what was your favorite thing that I showed in the video. I will pick one person at random one week from today and send it out to you wherever you are in the world. All the other details I will leave in the description box. So check there. And with all that said, thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you soon with a new one. Bye.